the stalwart patrons say their names with reverent pride. Welcome huh? Cuphead was donated by stalwart Weir, John Dom. We've gone back to the 1930s with Cuphead dancing Cuphead things. I'm gonna pay a price. Is this a threat? Let's go into the 1930s. So that Steamboat Mickey thing was 1928. Once upon a time in a magical place called Inkwell Isle, there were two brothers named Cuphead and Mugman. They lived without a cur to the watchful eye of the wise Elder Kettle. One day the two boys wandered far from home and despite the Elder Kettle's many warnings, on the wrong side of the tracks in the Devil's Cuisino. Inside, Cuphead and Mugman soon found themselves on a winning streak at the craft table. Hot dog! exclaimed King Dice, the casino sleazy manager. These fellas can't lose. Nice run, boys, laughed a newcomer. The brothers gaffed with the casino's owner, the devil himself. Now how about we raise the stakes, he suggested with a toothy grin. Win one more roll and all of my castle is yours, the devil boomed. If you lose, I'll have your souls. Deal? The idiots, blinded by easy riches, nodded and grabbed the dice for a throw. Good gosh, Cuphead, no, cried Bugman, finished with the danger. It was too late. Snake eyes laughed the devil while slamming the floor. You lose. The brothers trembled in fear as he loomed over them. Now, about those souls. The brothers plead for their very lives. There must be another way. We're hey, you, Mugman stammered. Yes, please, Mr. Cuphead added. Mm, perhaps there is the devil's dicker and pull out a parchment. I have, I have a list of my runaway debtors and creditors. Collect their souls, may I just by pardon you two bugs. Now get going, the devil roared, king of the world down so smoothly. You have till midnight tomorrow to collect every one of those souls. The lights will be going, thank you, going. All right, I'm getting bored of reading this. Just as it ended. A simple plot for all ages. And a, and a great lesson that gambling's for mugs. You get it? What a fine pickle you boys have got yourself into. I don't know what to be the point of the devil. What do you do? What do I can't bear to imagine your face. Now we play along for now. Collect those cards. <laughs> Remarkable key ability. Uh, regular? Is it like Mario World? What's going on? You just have to hold down the button, you don't have to tap it. Excellent. Die, you potato cunt. Die, you cunt. It's not over, now we've got uh, an onion. Crying. Right above me with tears. Cry me a river, you fucking cunt. I'm gonna dice you. Someone else back there, King Carrot. Next we'll be fighting a kickboxing banana. How do you get rid of it? Laser! Shoot him. Shit. We're in danger. I'm danger! I have to fight all of it again. Tedious! They've really captured that creepy animation style from the 1930s. I was a, a young punker that used to scare the shit out of me, this animation. Die, you potato cunt. Where's he getting the magic power to shoot lasers from his fucking finger? Cry, bitch. Yeah. 
Now King Carrot, the most cunning of them all. Yeah, fuck you, you cunt. Take him out! How many more hits? How many more hits, Carrot Man? K.O. C grade garbage. Does that mean we're free to wander do where are you? How much money did that carrot owe the cunt? Why is it diff different branch and complete path? This game's bonkers. You're up. But it captures the atmosphere of those old cartoons, no doubt about it. Literally looks like I'm in an animation. And even though gameplay wise it's the same old platform shit, it looks interesting in a typical modern game. A lot of kids today will have no idea what the fuck this old style animation even was. Some of us are old though. Fuck you, you bug! You plant oid. Look out behind me! This thing. Die plant. Reminds me of that game I was playing on the Amiga. Uh, Billy hashtag kid one. I forget what the fuck it was. See ya. Tough though. Don't mess with this game. Don't mess with this game! Here goes. We're running and gunning. He didn't have a gun like this, that fucking Billy hashtag green. What was it called? Rough and tumble? Very similar to that. Hard. They keep coming. Fuck you! I shot that son of a bitch! This thing keeps getting me. Don't do it! Freeze, please. Thing. Fuck you! That thing couldn't hurt my hero! Reveal! to shoot in all directions. Okay. Well, yeah. How are we gonna get that? We're not getting that far. Fuck you! How do you get your health back? What are you meant to do there? This is the first level, it's too hard, you stupid people who made this game. Too many coming again, new, coming again, new. There's no way Thrustgear's gonna beat this game. I've already been hit. It's already all over. Reveal.
The 1920s were deadly. If you uh, believe the 1920s were this deadly, well, now we know they were. Block off plant, man. Go away. And what do you do here? You can't double jump. What are you supposed to do? Why did I survive that then? I don't know. Fuck off. What's this thing? Stop it. The plantoid. Now what do you do again right there? Now what do you do again? Do it again there. The point of death, the point of truth. Hey! Now what do you do? Bravo! Thank you. That was annoying. Don't know how I got over that hole. See, fuck you. I've got money. I've got money, Mr. Witherspoon. I got plenty of money. Welcome. Welcome. I need. Oh, that dash move. I forgot about that. I've got that move, haven't I? Way spread. I like it. Goodbye. See ya. Give me the eight-way spread powers. What's this ugly coin down here? What's his problem? Okay. Let's see. He's just an informant. Let's go simple, this game's proving difficult. A great slam and then stop. Which weapon? It's on. Do I get this infinitely? It's a short range weapon. Woo! 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 Frog! I'm hitting him with more bullets than normal. Short range weapon. It's a short range, long range ship. You won't call me. Frog Brothers. What's this move? I'm going to avoid this one. Uh, what the? I'm in danger from all sides. Shit! Oh! The, the Frog Brothers are a, dead, a deadly threat. I'll shoot your flaming powers. I think I'm finally starting to understand. What's this? Don't go all the way over there, Flame B. Don't protect the Frog Brothers. They don't love you. Well, this move again. Shoot you. Wouldn't hurt me. What's this fucking move? Go 
Got one of them. Got them both. That was the easy version. Why would I want to make it harder? What? Fuck you, D. Revealing hidden areas. Okay, so why do you even bother with that then? We'll, we'll, we'll learn new things on the way. We'll come back for you, Frogoid. We'll come back. What's going on there, fish woman? Do we dare into this spooky area? The mausoleum? A great slam and then some. You're What's right. going on? The parry move. I died. Exit to map. Don't know what the parry move is. Let's keep moving. Branching multiple paths. Branching multiple paths. One begin with this. Regular, I guess. A great the boss fight. What the fuck? Fuck you! You can't! Bounces off the wall, that's where he gets me confused. What's this move? What's that gonna do? Oh. Nice sucker. If you stand here, he can never get you. Fuck! This map will get red hot. Ball bastard. Why'd he bounce off that time? Fuck you! Right, just kill me, it's already gone wrong. Fuck you, pal. A brawl is surely brutal. Here goes. Just be right near him when he's jumping about. Ah! He's a cunt. He's a cunt. He's good now. Fuck this boss. To jump over when he does that move. That's a trick. Okay. Fuck this game. He's a cunt. Sometimes his jump is bigger and more potent. Can't predict what he's gonna do. You can. Fuck off! Going bigger. Oh, you can dash on the ground too. Fuck! You didn't get up in time. Sometimes he doesn't do it! Keep moving. Gotta be another way we can go. He's dead and he's optional. What the fuck? How'd you get up there? Don't tell me he's next and that's that. How'd you jump? So we have to kill this guy. We'll have to go simple. Fuck you! Whoops, I keep forgetting he bounces off the wall like a cocksucker.
Fuck off! What am I meant to do there? The 1920s can fuck off. I can't even beat him on simple mode! Well, this might be the end of this game. A powerful donation, but a fruitless one. There's no one else to go, no one else I can beat. That's that. The ghouls, I don't even get what you do there. So I guess it's over. Hope oh, you enjoyed it. See you later. I don't have to take that from you. Give me your best shot. I'm just gonna stand here and let you throw punches. Come on. I can't penetrate the dragon bone armor. Heart man, put a fucking arrow through his heart. Good work. Well, that could have turned out better. Sven, you're looking handsome in this new remastered edition. Thank you. Oh!